Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today we're tackling a question that many Go developers encounter. How to compare two string values in a case-insensitive manner. This is crucial for ensuring that your applications treat strings like A and A as equal, which can be essential for user input and data validation. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we're going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully get to that resolution. Now, let's get on to the video. To compare two strings in Go without considering case sensitivity, we can use the strings package, which provides useful functions for string manipulation. Next, we will use the toLower function from the strings package. This function converts both strings to lowercase before comparing them. Now let's complete the comparison. If the lowercase versions of the strings are equal, we can return true. Here's the complete code snippet for comparing two strings case insensitively. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To compare two strings in Go without worrying about case sensitivity, you can convert both strings to either lowercase or uppercase. This way, you can ensure an accurate comparison. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To compare two strings in Go without considering case, you can use a custom function. This function converts each character to lowercase and compares them one by one. If the strings are equal, the function returns zero. If one is less than the other, it returns negative or positive values accordingly. Additionally, you can create a function to check for equality using this comparison function, making it easy to determine if two strings are the same, ignoring case. And that's it, guys. I hope the video has helped find you to that resolution and you're able to get through your problem. If you did, guys, please hit subscribe. I really appreciate it. It does help me out. And until next time, have a good one.